Hey guys, it's Hexer18 again, and in this video I'm going to show you another Backtrack 5 tutorial on the VNC server that I was telling you guys in the previous video. Um, so I'm going to show you in Backtrack 5 here in my VMware Fusion. On um, It's in the set, which is Social Engineering Toolkit, so I'm just going to go there. Okay, so what we wanted to go from the menu here is we want to go to website attack vectors number two and then we want to do a number one a Java applet attack method. So you might have seen my Java applet attack method video. Well here's another uh, cool um, exploit that I was messing around with and I wanted to share with you guys. So anyways I'm just going to choose a web template and uh, it says do you want to do net pa uh, port forwarding? No, um, because this is going to be on my local network. Uh, the IP address of the reverse connection. So, uh, new tab and then it wants to know my IP address of my local network here and this machine for backtrack is 192.168.1.138. So paste, press enter, and I want to do, let's try, I like Facebook because the Java works in, like instantly. So I press enter, and the one I wanted to show you guys was number three here, Windows Reverse TCP VNC DLL. It spawns a VNC server on the victim. Um, let's see if that shows what it says the rest here. No, it doesn't. It's cut off. So, um... I want to do number three, so press three, enter. Uh, number 16, the backdoor executable works the best. So I'm going to use 16, press enter. The port, I always use 4444. All right. And then it asks me if they, I want to create one for Linux and OS X. I'm going to say no, because I'm going to test it on Windows, Windows 7. Starting the payload handler. Okay, so now Metasploit has done everything for us, what we need to do here. And I'm going to go ahead and open Minimize Backtrack 5 here and go to Windows 7. Okay, Windows 7. So I'm going to go to Internet Explorer here. Uh, just go to home page, which is Google. Okay. And then if they type in the IP address or if you have your own server, like I talked earlier about the external IP address or having your website redirect to your external IP address, okay, then this would be the example. But do not use your local unless you're doing this over a local network. So 138, press enter, should show Facebook uh, a fake site. Here we are. Okay, now Java is automatically doing its thing. So I'm going to minimize Windows 7, go back to Backtrack 5, and it should say Launch VNC Viewer. There it is. And we got this shell here. I want to see if it's open in Windows 7. Yes, it is. So whatever you see, I wonder if you can type in it. Let me check. No, I don't. I don't think you can. Oh, maybe you can. Yep, you can type in it. That's kind of cool. And then you could probably hit enter. Oh wow, that's kind of cool. You can change it to like Google. Change the site, and you can watch what they're doing, stuff like that. That's awesome. So, um, whoops, I didn't want to do that. Um. Yeah, that's what this does. It's the VNC server exploit. So, um, oh, Java update. I'm just going to say no to that. Um, comment, rate, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think about this uh, uh, this exploit, um, this um, handler here. I thought it was really awesome. Um, I just wanted to share it with you guys. So, 
uh, comment, rate, subscribe, you know, give me some recommendations, like I said, um, I want to hear from you guys, so, uh, thanks for watching guys, I appreciate it, I'll talk to you guys later, see ya.